love to dig dirt up. I've been digging dirt up for 20 years. Do you think I'm going to talk about gardening? Do you think I'm talking about writing articles for New Idea? No, it's about genealogy. I love to search for three pieces of evidence to support my hunch. This curiosity I bring to my work. I love to dig and understand the landscape that I'm working in. Three years ago, I joined an organisation that was on the verge of extinction. But just a year later, with a swoop of a pen, it all changed, the landscape changed. We were back in business, but we had a problem. We were an IT provider that our customers loved to hate. We had to change. So we dug deep. We took the time to listen to our customers and our teams about what was focused customer service. Easy, not quite. My chief executive came up with being of service as a corporate value. I pulled back. I thought about it. That sounds like being in servitude. My Irish Catholic ancestry didn't like that at all. So what did we do? It made me think that we had people scurrying around trying to please, and I wanted my technical specialists to understand they were knowledge leaders. I wanted our customers to experience that knowledge when they were working with our teams to solve problems. But it did make bring come back to me, and I did think, so what does being a service mean for me as a leader? And my son came up with a very important lesson for me. He's a teenager, and I relish when I he decides he wants to have a chat. So I was listening carefully when he was explaining to me what his experience of being a leader was like at his school. He said, it's not about ego and power, Mum. He said, leadership is about serving your community. And that made me think, OK, so what I'm, what's my serving my community look like? I really thought and thought, and I asked and discussed with other people, and it came up to me that what my purpose was, was to listen, understand, and help individuals reach their potential. 2016 was a tough year. It was a big year for us. But I grinned with delight when one of my team members said, she had a career now, it wasn't just a job. I love to hear how a customer said they sound like they're smiling when you talk to them on the phone. So 2017 is going to be a bigger year. It's going to be a really tough year. But what I need to not forget is that how I can serve my community is by creating the environment to let my team succeed. Through their success, will be the success of our organisation. It looks like I'm going to keep on digging.